Hello there, everybody. Uh, today we're going to do another big notebook. It is the 8x10 collection. Well, I, you know the first ones aren't 8x10. Of Hollywood, 8x10 Hollywood A. That does make sense. Well, I guess the first one's misfiled. <laughs> A to whatever. A to G, I think, is a... Uh, so let me get started here. This is why I get thrown off. First one's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Got that years ago. Uh, Maureen McCormick. She's signed in black. Over her black outfit. So that one was... A lot of these are older ones. Elizabeth Shue. Got that a while ago. Uh, Deborah Adair. She was a soap, uh, soap star. Kristen Alfonso. Sign right there. One of the first big autographs I got. Tried to get her. Tried to be her fan club, which she already had one. So. Didn't get that. Wrote her letter, but she wrote a nice letter back. Uh, Steve Allen, signed in blue. Steve Allen's, of course, no longer with us. Died several years ago. Tim Allen, I used to sign a, a full signature. You can actually see the Allen, Allen in his signature. Uh, that was again early days of home improvement, so he's got home improvements. That was his photo. Robert Altman. This one I got recently. Eric Anderson, Friday the 13th. There you go. One of Burt Reynolds' ex wives. Got Lonnie Anderson. Tom Arnold, he signed right along the bottom there. A little hard to see. I think this was part of a trade because I didn't, I didn't know at the time who this was. Armand Asante, he signed up there. A lot of these stars used to do black and whites and they signed on the dark part of their photos, so. Here's Conrad Bain, deceased, former different stroke sign right down there. Come on, get in there. Try and put him back as, as I show him. So to Brian, best wishes from your television friend, Bob Barker. <clears throat> and then I got another one years later. Hi Brian, Bob Barker. So that was the first one. That's... Drew Barrymore. That one I think I bought. Uh, this one back, she used to sign. Oops, I got two there. Kim Bassinger. She used to sign her autographs there. Uh, let's see. So there's Brian up there. Uh, something love Kim Bassinger. She's a great actress. Kathy Bates. And another one I'm proud of. This one I completed. TTM. Batman. The cast of the original Batman. Adam West. Yvonne Craig. And Burt Ward. All gotten through the mail. Can't do that anymore. Candace Bergen. Not just because one's deceased, but just because nobody, you always find someone who doesn't sign through the mail. Honor Blackman from the Avengers and other movies. The Avenger, uh, 
Not the Avengers you might be thinking of. You think of New Avengers. Uh, the old British spy show, The Avengers. Robert Blake. Got before his prison time. So, he always had messy signature. Lewis Black. Got uh, Lewis. Through the mail. Oh, pretty much 90% of these are through the mail. Paisley Blackburn, I'll have to admit, I didn't know who she was when I got her, but I saw she sent a picture through the mail, so I went and got it. She wrote that in the back. Brian. Greetings from Indiana. Thank you so much for being a fan. Means the world to me. Wishing you much love and future success. Cheers, Paisley Blackburn. Okay, I have to admit it's embarrassing. It's from my favorite movie, Megaforce. Barry Bostwick. I should have got her to sign up, but now I'm not so sure. She used to sign. I got her to sign uh, the Star Trek cast photo, but didn't think of sending this one. And I don't think I'll sign it now because I don't think she'll sign. Uh, Megaforce, for you haven't seen it, it's a campy 70s film. Where they have a, they make a multinational uh, secret force with high tech weapons and it's all it's pretty campy. Jeff Bridges, the dude. They have to go take out some third world dictator and he's his friend, so it's pretty funny. Todd Bridges. My favorite line of the thing is they they want to lay on their transport plane at the end and to rescue them all and he's got a very tight landing space with a bunch of people shooting at him and everything. And they tell him it's gonna to be tough. He says, Ah, eh, it's no worse than landing in O'Hare, which is a Chicago airport. Morgan Brittany. So being from the Chicago area, I love that line. And the pilot, by the way, is the doctor from, uh, not Dr. Early, the other doctor from Emergency. I can't remember his name. It's Charles Bronson, early on. Here's another early Albert Brooks. I say early, but he's probably fairly big then. And Jerry Brockenheimer. And another Jerry Brockenheimer. That's one I sent. And this one he sent. Uh, it took several years to get that. It was out several years, but he finally did it. This one, who knows? Now, I know some of you will say it's sectarial, some will say it's real, who knows, but I like it. It's in my collection. Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. Paul Newman and Robert Redford. So, then, there you get Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. Next one, George Burns. You got the sign early on his career. I mean, not early his career, but early in my collecting uh, now that I look at it again, it looks like it's might be a stamp, but I still like it. You might use the pen, it's fading. I don't know. Brett Butler sent recently to a compatriot of hers, uh, Julie White, who's on Broadway. As I mentioned, they were in the show Grace Under Fire together. I mentioned that. You've seen this if you watch my videos any long, any amount of time. This is Ruth Buzzy. John Carpenter. He was. It's my picture, I think. And then he sent me a picture. And the typical, this is pre print or. But it's got years and years and years ago. Uh, when we first got on the scene, so Jim Carrey. So 
everybody got those. Uh, here's the one I, I value. It was early on. He used to, as you can see, I used to buy movie stills. John Candy. Movie stills used to be very affordable. They used to have a place that bought them. I bought them from that had them for like you know a dollar a piece or something, or maybe even cheaper. I think you can find sales George Carlin. Um, you can find them on sale even cheaper, like quarter or fifty cents a piece if you bought bulk of you know little known movies, which I used to do. Linda Carr. So I'd send them off to get signed because those days, those were about the only way you could do it. You couldn't, you didn't buy photos. You couldn't get photos off the internet. There was no internet, basically. Here is Dana Carvey. He is, he signed a ballpoint up there. So. Mr. Chevy Chase, early in his career, so he signed full name he still has science say but it's mainly a CC or maybe a C chase or something another movie still I bought there's Lois Childs Glenn Close see this old it, they were movie stills given to TV. They were given to TV and to advertise movies. And it says on uh, Manny Batakin, Glenn Close pictured left to right, and Ruth Garden starring Maxie, Wednesday, May 22nd at 1230 p.m. on KTYU Channel 2. So look at that. George Clooney bought this early on. I don't know if it's authentic or not, but Calvin Colbert, old movie star. Here's Joan Collins. It's a show on the Connery. That's up to choir. What we'll star this is? Who is this? Oh, this is Charles Cooper. Charles Cooper. I was happy to get him a sign. He sent another photo, which I don't have in here. Hey, hey, hey. Bill Cosby. I got long before his jail time and suspected stuff. Uh, this is an old address. I'll, I'll actually shouldn't show it because of grant theft, but yeah, letter also. Don't want people knowing old addresses too. Kevin Costner signed thin Sharpie. Us, huh? And we got the last of them. Charlie Cox. He was in the Broadway play with uh, Tom Hiddleston, so I sent them both in. Got them, got them both off Broadway. So there is some success. You do have some success on Broadway. Courtney Cox, a trade for this one. Sign there, down there. Walter Cronkite used to be the newsman for K uh, cable news. Everybody tuned in. He was CBS. Everybody tuned in to see Walter Cronkite. Walter Cronkite. Here is Kathy Lee Crosby. That was. It's 1976, so y'all coach. The movie Coach. <clears throat> I thought that was Piranha. 
Piranha is another movie. I think I don't remember she was in it. Jamie Lee Curtis. About that photo. She's in it red near the top. And right behind her, got her dad, Tony Curtis. Uh, another one I gotta be truthful with you. I didn't know who she was when I sent it for her. Carolyn Dodd from Get Shorty. I saw she was sending out 8 by 10s and just went ahead and tried her. So I got her. So, Carolyn Dodd. Tony Danza. All the best. Another movie one. Another still for movie. Gina Davis. What a rapping her. She had some big roles back in the day. Early David Letter uh yeah, David Letterman person. Calvin DeForest played uh oh shoot. I wanna say his name oh, shoot is Larry. I forgot what he called him. Larry or Bob or something. Something simple. But he became a, a reporter on Lerman Show and he used to always hit him in situations. Really funny. Uh, breakdown. This is signed by uh, Martha De Laurentiis. I was the only person on the photo that would sign. So I went ahead and sign, sent it. So, she is the daughter, I believe, of Dino DeLantis, famous movie director. So, there you go. Movie still, I knew Kurt Russell wouldn't sign. Some others, I just forget it. Rebecca DeMornay, Risky Business, and some other stuff. I can't remember any of her other hits. Brian Dennehy. Might remember him recently, uh, uh, before he died, what, as he died, he was on Blacklist, he played the grandfather, father, and he, lots of great movies, FX was a great movie, so, one from Taxi Driver, Robert De Niro, again, this was gotten t probably 20 years ago, so I think it was authentic, that was before the autograph craze took off, people, Stars weren't getting that many that many people's that that many things to sign, so I like to think that that's authentic. Angie Dickinson, policewoman. There's one, 1995. Phyllis Diller. Look at 95. That was what was that? I've 20, 25, 27 years ago. Elaine, Elaine, Eileen Donahue. Eileen Donahue. There's one from The Omen. Look at that. Uh, I got written in the back, Richard Donner. He was the director of The, o the Omen. And... I don't know what, it looks like they have all sorts of different things written on the back, like when they, like how much color or negative, so that's interesting, but here's William Defoe, Green Goblin, but this is an early picture, another big newsman. Hugh Downs, ABC. Uh, Robert Duvall. That's, like, that's from, uh, I think he was in Lonesome Dove. Now, people always say these are uh, sectarian or something. 
I got them years and years ago. At least it was made in '86. So I got it probably in '80s, early '90s. Clint Eastwood, Heartbreak Ridge. Uh, got it when he was mayor of the little town. Here's another one. And this is Magnum Force. So I don't know if they're authentic, but a lot of people say his are all pre 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 uh, not pre print uh, sectorial, so I don't know. Here's an older Sam Elliott. Guys sign along there. Old picture of him. Oh, what movie that's from him? Jeff Fahey, he was a big star for a while. Started in a series of Marshall. Had a lot of other roles. Here is Peter Falk. Here is Stephanie Farsi. She's with Cleavon Little. Uh, in the movie True Colors, uh, Cleavon's unfortunately passed away, so I won't get the sign by both. Oh, here's, you know, I was just wondering. I saw yesterday people were uh, old posts for Show Off Sunday in a couple of the groups. People had pictures of Fair Fawcett up they got. And I was wondering if I got Fair Fawcett. I, I couldn't remember. But here it is, 1995. Or faucet. Another deceased woman is Carrie Fisher from when Harry Met Sally. Here's one. I've got another one out to her right now. Uh, but I get this one signed. Jane Fonda. I think that's the graduate I think is no it's not the graduate not sure what that is and then Morgan Freeman don't know if it's authentic but actually I don't know it might be stamp preprint I don't know preprinter I've got to take a look at these with my jewelers Louvre, which I didn't have back in back in the day. Jeff Foxworthy, I remember Jeff Foxworthy. I asked for an eight by ten, and I got a note back with my index card signed. Said if you want eight by ten, send a dollar to him, and he would send one back out to me. So that cost me a dollar, maybe a two dollars. But I'll never forget it. His company was called Coffee Top Productions, I believe it was. So, what I did, him and his wife were running the company at the time. Saw a biography on him. He was a very interesting person, still is. Um, all the stuff he does, he still teaches, like, Sunday school and, and everything. He's very religious, very... And he... Uh, I think he's it's in Atlanta. He goes in, teaches at Sunday school once a week, and it it's and you don't hear of it because he just keeps a low key. It's, he's just Jeff when in there. So, but he tells people about his life and how you know anybody could do what he does. Anyway, I hope you all have a good day. Um, seems to be the trend here. All the videos I watch, people always say that. But anyway, uh, I hope your mailboxes are full. Tune in every Friday for my, uh, what I got for the week video, which is a combination of patches, uh, police and fire patches, uh, fan packs, which are items gotten from companies or schools. Uh, hero cards, which are from auto racing, they're usually 8x10, 
and I get them both signed and unsigned. Signed playbills from Broadway plays. Uh, let's see, what else do I get? I just get anything through the mail, basically, I collect. I love getting mail. Uh, but in the meantime, I hope your, your mailboxes are full. Oh, uh, tour my collection. You can watch a lot of the past videos already up. They come out every Wednesday. And I have yet quite a few still notebooks to go. Um, some of the highlights, I have my cartoons. Um, I have political, or no, political stuff. Cartoons, I have a lot of different racing ones. I have my White Sox collection. Um, I think 8x10s are done. There's three notebooks of them. I think they might be done, may not be. But there's all sorts of stuff yet to see. So tune in, subscribe to the channel, please. And tell your friends to subscribe to the channel also and take a look at the different videos I have. Thanks and have a great day.